everybody Ann here, sitting here having my coffee. It's a very chilly kind of dreary day, as usual, I guess, this time of the year. Uh, today's the day that I take Papa to the vet. Now, when you see this, it'll be like yesterday. <laughs> so when you watch this, I mean, I record and I publish the next day. Um, I will probably have already told you how things went, but uh, I'm really nervous about this, so... <sighs> I'm hoping that everything goes well. So to cheer me up, I am going to show you this little clip that somebody sent me via Facebook Messenger. Don't know where the video origin originated, but it is funny. So here, take a look at this. told you it was funny. Isn't it funny? I have watched that clip probably a hundred times. It just cracks me up. I don't know. I've never heard a rooster do that kind of cuckle doodle do before. So it cheers me up. If I ever need to get cheered up, I just go to that video and oh my gosh, it makes me just laugh, laugh, laugh. Anyway, it's time for me to get dressed and take the big boy to the vet. Well, I'm in the truck. I got the big boy in the truck with me. And guess what? If this day couldn't be any more stressful, oh gosh, please let it start. It started. All right, off to the bed. I'm gonna be a little bit late. I'm gonna give him a call and hopefully I'll still be able to get him in. Whew, dang it. Okay, we're here. I've called, it's only curbside service. So I'm praying right now that there's no microchip and this gets to be my dog. All right, they just took him in, um, and he didn't seem upset to go into the vet. I hope it stays that way. Whew, I'm saying a prayer right now. Heavenly Father, please let there be no chip. Please let him be healthy. <sighs> please, please. <sighs> I could almost cry right now. No microchip. They're going to treat him, or, you know, test him, treat him, whatever. No microchip. He's my dog. Oh, and I just have to tell you guys, when they called to tell me he had no chip, um, she, the, the lady kind of turned around and laughed at me, or laughed on the phone. She says, and he knows how to open up doors. He just opened up the door and came right out. She was sitting at the desk. I guess he pushed on the door, opened it, and came out and was wandering around. And they've already fallen in love with him <laughs> because he's a great dog. So I'll keep you updated. Um, I'm going to go make that community post right now. Well, they've brought him out. Um, he's in good health. They say he's 18 months to two years old and parasite free, except for heartworms. He's heartworm positive. I know it, I know, you wanna go home. He's a good boy. I'm gonna take good care of him. We're just waiting, waiting on them to bring out his medicine and whatnot. Um, they said he did really good in there and he's very, very friendly. He wants to go back in with the girls, don't you? <laughs> God love him. This is a first. I didn't think I was gonna get any eggs today. And God has blessed me with three. Oh, thank you. Here's all my eggs. These last three, one, two, three, uh, I picked out today. And they look like they're about the same size as the other eggs. So yeah, yeah, this one might be a little bit bigger, but Oh, look at that. Three eggs in one day. Can you believe it, you guys? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm going to pickle these. I know I keep saying that, but it excites me. <laughs> I'm excited over pickled eggs. Together again. They're happy. Yep, they're happy. And Papa's going to be just fine. We're home now. Um, I've let the chickens out. You just saw. Um three eggs today. That's pretty thrilling. So I'm starting the heartworm treatment. Um, I'm going to let them play for a little bit first before I start giving him um, his stuff. Uh, <laughs> it's going to be just fine. Um, so I'm going to pickle some eggs. I'm not going to show you do it. I'm just going to chill out because I'm such a nervous Nelly. I get nervous, way more nervous than other people about things like this. 
but Papa's going to be just fine, and he did really well at the vet today. But I did want to show you one, well, three other things. Um, Miss Donna B wasn't done sending me videos, so or DVDs. So I'm going to show you the other three movies that she sent me. This one is Billy Elliot. I don't know what it is, but it says funny on it, so it's right up my alley. The next one is Gene Hackman in Hoosiers. I think I like that too. Oh, yes. And now this one I've seen and I love, love, love this movie. It is Bruce Willis in the Sixth Sense. This is a great movie. So I'm looking forward to watching it. I may even watch it today. Um, so I'm going to be reading up on this heartworm stuff and whatnot. Um, she said it's very, very common, and um, I've got some antibiotics in here. I've got, I don't know, something else, um, sample medication. Um, so, you know what? I'm just tired, but it went well today, um, except the heartworm bird, but that's okay because they said, well, you know, out here, lots of dogs get it, um, and he's a relatively young dog, they said, between 18 months and two years, so... Um, he's going to be just fine, and I'm going to be able to handle this just fine, um, no problems. So for the rest of the day, I'm just going to keep warm because it's freezing. I've got the propane going right now, but I'm going to start a fire here in a minute. i got to go outside and bring some more wood from the inside and transfer the wood from the wood pile to the, <laughs> to the front porch, but I just want to get this tiny house warmed up here real quick. And then, hmm... Yeah, I'm not going to say it again. I, I, I'm going to do something with those eggs. You know what I'm going to do. <laughs> I can't wait. I don't know if I'm going to use apple cider vinegar this time or um, white vinegar. I actually kind of like the taste with the white vinegar. And I've got some of that on hand. So I'm going to do that. Put something to cook on the wood-burning stove. I'm kind of in the mood for some kind of lasagna. I don't have any ricotta cheese or cottage cheese. I do have mozzarella cheese, but you know what? I can I can improvise like I always do. And just kind of do some organizing because with all the, the new things that I've been getting here and there, you know, either I bought myself or people bought for me. I got to find places for them all. Uh, I got to take out this one cabinet. Um, what else? What else? You know, I think that's going to be it. It for this video, not a super long one. I don't got anything else to say. I just want to relax and enjoy my dog. Anyhow, that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.